go and pick up my brand new caravan. So um, we're on our way up to the border. Unfortunately, um, we've had to get it shipped from Queensland in New South Wales because of the restrictions at the moment. Makes it a bit more challenging, but uh, we're gonna do a swap over in uh, Tweed Heads and that'll allow me to bring the van back. So I'll get it home, we'll get it clean, and we'll look forward to taking you for a tour around the new Titan Blackhawk 595 bunk van. Beast. Titan Blackhawk. Woo! 595 Bunky. What do you think, Hugo? Yeah, cool. Pretty cool? Yeah. Oh, look at this. What a rig. But I think me and Nadi should share toes on the top bunk. You want to share on the top bunk? Yeah. Okay, well, you can work that out with your brother. How's that sound? Yeah. All right. Awesome. Ooh. Just picked up the Titan Blackhawk. We've uh, just gone through Tweed Heads, navigated some roundabouts, a few twists and turns, and we're just starting to uh, get up to our first 100k, towing the, the lovely Blackhawk. And look, it's sitting really well. So far, it's riding well. Cruise is pulling with ease and a uh, beautiful sunny day, can't ask for much more. We'll get a few Ks under our belt and I'll let you know what my, th my thoughts are. So my first about 60 k's down now, we've gone through the Byron Hills and it's towing like an absolute dream. It's a, wouldn't even know it's back there, besides the big fuel bill, which is pretty uh, much expected when you're towing a, a big van in a cruiser. But it's just gliding up the hills, it's sitting so solid on the road, um, it's just straight on a 50 mil ball it, it, um, and hitch, there's no um, sway bars or anything like that at all. So I'm just really impressed with just how well it just follows the cruiser. Um, obviously the cruiser is a beautiful thing to tow with, but it's just it's just sitting in there past some trucks. We've uh, had plenty of other things come past us, um, you know, a couple of big, big B doubles, and it's just not shaken. It just sits really well and solid on the road. So let's see what the, the next 200 Ks is gonna tell us. Sugarcane country, there it is there. Look at that, they're burning away the fields. Just looking absolutely magic on such a cool night. How awesome is that? They've just started a fresh fire right there. Just on the back of the paddock that we're in passing. There it is there. Oh, what a magical sight. How cool is that? Don't know if you can hear the crackle there. All that sugar cane just popping, sounds amazing. But just such a cool sight, we just can't get closer to that unfortunately, but if you ever get the chance and get close to it, um, you can really hear that crack and the pop of that, that sugar cane as it burns. Uh, there's a really beautiful smell, obviously like sugar. Um, it's, it's just being burnt and um, yeah, just really cool to be able to share with kids. Oh, 
that's magical. That's what you want in a van. You just want it to sit nice and steady on the road, follow your vehicle, and not be affecting what you're doing as a driver. So that just shows great balance in that in that van. So we've arrived, we've unhooked, quick turn on a few lights, open a few things, um, have a quick look around, little sneak peek for you. Uh, it's time for bed, I'm absolutely shattered, so uh, thanks very much. We'll catch you next time with a full review of the 595 Bunk. Thanks guys, have a good one.